Hey guys, welcome back to Jurassic Collectibles. I've got my tea and I'm ready for another review. So today we're going to be looking at something completely different and it's this. It's the Tomy Dinosaur line. Now this comes from Japan. As you can see it's got some nice Japanese lettering going along the top here. And these are fairly small figurines. They measure, as you can see, 150 millimeters, so about 15 centimeters across, which is about three or four inches. Uh, so not very big at all. But I did notice that when I was looking at these, the Triceratops and the Raptor, and actually the Brachiosaurus, not so much the T-Rex, but these three guys do resemble the dinosaurs we see in Jurassic Park. So I thought it was worth picking these guys up. So I've got the Triceratops here today, and uh, as you can see, one of the interesting features on the back of the packaging is that the skin is removable, so it actually has dino damage, uh, which is very similar to what the Jurassic Park toys had. As you can see, the Brachiosaurus seems to have a bit of a problem with his tail. It's completely upright there, uh, which I think is to help him stand up. But uh, that's why I didn't go for this guy. I decided to go for this one for now. And actually, the, the Triceratops there does look like the Jurassic Park design. Pretty cool. So we'll see what that looks like out of the box. And also the Raptor as well, if I'm not mistaken, does look very similar to the Raptors that we see in the Lost World. So there's the back of the packaging. And on the side we just got some more information. And yeah, just got the logo at the top there. So this comes from Tomy. Let's get this thing out of the packaging. Okay, so inside the packaging uh, you get the Triceratops and it looks very nice. It looks like the paint job is pretty cool. So I'm really excited to get this one out of the packaging. And you get a little bag of sweets. Now I'm not sure if I really trust these. Um, they do look a little bit pill-like, so uh, maybe be wary if you buy one of these. Um, I, I don't think I'm going to eat these, but there we go. Okay, so here's what came in the bag. And I'm always impressed with Japanese products because they always come with great instruction manuals. And this one is no exception. We've got a nice little um, diagram here showing how the horns that come separately attach and also the skin where that gets attached. So that's really nice. And actually there's nothing on the inside. On the outside you've got a nice picture of the Triceratops. Um, so there, and you can see it's number two. So that's nice. So, here is the Triceratops uh, that comes in the back. And actually, it's not a bad little sculpt. And the paint job isn't too bad either. It does remind me very much of the concept artwork by Crash McCreary uh, for Jurassic Park. So let's put the horns on. I thought we'd do that together. Let's have a look. Maybe that goes on that side. That's one. So they've actually made these little horn pieces, one smaller than the other, so that you know that this is this side and this is the other side. And actually, the horn detail is very nice indeed. So there he is. And I have to say, he does resemble the Triceratops you see in Jurassic Park. Very, very cool. And there's the dino damage. And actually, it's a really nice detail. They've got all the striations in the muscles there. It really does look like the flesh has come off. Um, I mean, this guy wasn't very expensive. Um, I think it was about three pounds. Um, so you can find him on eBay at the moment. So uh, I'd say it's a very good little purchase. Nice little figurine, measuring roughly 15 centimeters across. Maybe it's nice for your desk. In terms of articulation, you can rotate his legs forward and backward. A little bit stiff to start off with, but after that, oh. <laughs> <laughs> Let's put that one back on. There we go. So mind his legs because they will come off. And yeah, so they are really stiff to start off with, but they do come out, so it's okay. Don't worry, you haven't broken it if they come out. There we go. So there we go. And that's all the all the limbs moving about now. <laughs> that did make me laugh. And then here's the removable piece of flesh. So let's put that in. And there's the dino damage. Pretty cool. So I think this guy is very, very impressive. It's made by Tomy, and actually Tomy have got a good reputation for doing things in a very detailed way. He's a lovely little figurine, he's painted really well, he's sculpted well. Oh, there's a little thumb thing so you can get the bit out. That's good, look at that, excellent. So um, yeah, I have to say I'm very impressed with this little figure. So there we have it, that was the Triceratops uh, number two figurine from Tomy. I think I will pick up a, a few more of these 
and um, I'll do a review maybe on the Raptor first and then the Brachiosaurus if I can get over that weird tail. But uh, there we go guys, I hope you enjoyed this review, rate, comment and subscribe and I'll see you in the next video.